to find their daughter be upset about that right think about that think about that part of the game is that seem like out there in Tennessee they make it seem like every single man beats the shit out of his woman and every single man or every single woman you know cheats on his man I mean I don't know what the preconceived notion is man Katie you been saying that shit man don't come over here with that shit you said last week you was going to rehab you still ain't done that Come over here with that shit. I don't want to hear that, man. You come over here with that silly shit. Go, go. <laughs> I don't want to hear that, Candace. Hell no. Well, come over here with that fair weather, fair weather fan ass shit. I don't want to hear about it, man. Stay away. For real, bro. Like y'all, you and your husband, bro. I'll put up with some foul ass shit to be next to y'all, man. Some foul ass shit to, <laughs> Man, some real regular Fucking hillbilly cracker ass White people shit Didn't make me question Who the fuck, what the fuck am I What the fuck am I doing I tried to keep the ass out of here You came over here with that silly shit, woman Man, take that bullshit on I don't want to hear about none of that going to work shit Find your fucking daughter shit Tell me something about that, you dig I don't want to hear none about this shit Got me fucked up. All the shit I done went through and the best you got is to come over here and say, this, that, or the third. You left the hill twice. Looking ass. Man, just, just, just stay from around me. <laughs> this ain't gonna be about you no more. This ain't gonna be about your dirtbag ass husband no more either guess what due process I could have never came in on this one and done due process cause you motherfuckers are scumbags it had to have been a worse motherfucker on that hill than you than, than you two that day had to have been and for nine fucking months I put up for you fucking sorry losing motherfuckers you're gonna lose every fucking day Every fucking day. Quit being a bitch and bring that girl home. Fuck you talking about. Coming over here with that. I gotta go to work. Motherfucker, last Thursday you said you was going to rehab and you ain't done that shit neither. And guess what? To do that, you will get you'll reap a you'll reap a, a bigger, a bigger seed by going to rehab and going to work. Going to work gets you another bottle of fucking whiskey. Going to rehab gets you your fucking kids. 
Make that make sense. See, I try to stay away. I want to stay away. <laughs> but let me tell you what, it should have been a different case. I came in here and tried to be fucking prolific. Because guess what, man? These, these motherfuckers, man, these, these people ain't it. These ain't the ones, man. <laughs> I burnt my whole shit up behind these mo- I thought, you know what? I thought, I honestly thought, man, I can make something shake. I can really, I can really help these folks. You folks are past help. And, and, and I hate that today I'm saying it because I should have never been able to say this shit today because I should have been able to hold it in, but it's only by God's grace. I've been blessed with a vent valve today to let you know you deserve every single thing coming your way for the rest of eternity. Mama, I promise you, bring that baby home. Free that child. Free that child. I've never seen such cow, cow, cowardry, cowardness in my life. Cowardness. The cowardness. The cowardice. Man, this ain't it. This ain't it. You mean to tell me this was my debut and I picked a couple of motherfuckers that was doing dope and fucking admitting to fucking little kids online and shit? You motherfuckers were the ones I chose? Man, guess what? Due process watchers. Anytime they look or sound like them two motherfuckers, man, don't jump shit like Benny did. Just don't get involved. I could have never helped them folks. They used me. Y'all used me. That's what the fuck y'all done. And then guess what? It's you and your husband created this bullshit that I fucked you out there in Tennessee and all kind of bullshit. And meanwhile, you're having fun with it. I don't want to come here. This was not supposed to be like this. Oh, shit. This wasn't supposed to be like this. But guess what? It is. You didn't use every motherfucker that came across. You, 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 you and your husband had expected other motherfuckers to come to your house and drywall it. I mean, that's what the fuck your husband does. Funny is it takes some motherfucking me drywall to bring them boys home in a little rehab and y'all can't pull it together why you told me you was going through rehab at your house no 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 it's too many fucked up things it's too many too many fucked up things. It's too many fucked up things y'all got going down on one piece of paper, man, and the shit. The shit can't never fucking ride smooth. It won't. You got the mic's uh, uh, hard lemonade way back since the fucking Jump Street. Since Jump Street. You people abuse every single person you get around and now all of a sudden I get to the bottom of this shit and y'all motherfuckers want me to hide some information about a phone that could potentially help a little girl that y'all still come here every fucking day. What the fuck do you look like coming here looking for that little fucking girl and you won't turn that motherfucking phone in? Huh? <laughs> Girls, tell the truth and shut the devil. Tell the truth and shut the fucking devil. You're here saying free kid or a free, free, a free Donnie and all this other bullshit. And all you got to do is turn the phone and it look like right, huh? Huh? <laughs> Don't come here and say, um, help us find summer no more if you won't turn the fucking phone in. Sandman, you shouldn't even be running a fucking website that says find summer wells when you got the fucking info off of this man's fucking phone in your cock sucking computer, my friend. You ain't the one. 
Man down. You should have worked shit, bro. What the fuck you look like running a site that says find Summer Wells? And you got the info on the computer. And you said, oh, if they come around here asking, looking ass, what do you mean? County King Sport. I asked to put this flyer up to the clerk. I know her personally. It's not her fault. But I asked if I could put it in the window and she was like, well, you can put it on that mirror over there because um, the chain itself doesn't allow anything on the pumps, windows, etc. And I started talking to her a little bit more and I was like, why, why can't I put this up? And she said, well, this gas station chain thinks it looks tacky. My jaw dropped. I said, a missing five-year-old girl's flyer looks tacky. This is the problem we have right now. We have to change this stuff, guys. We have to speak out about it. The news channels don't want to listen, so we're going to. God bless you guys. Just wanted to let you know this. John has his foot so far on Candace's neck. He can't do shit. Okay? Now... Come back to this, okay? Wait a minute. So, wait. So, Don, can, Candy Kane knew that Don was taking showers with Summer and molesting her, and there was a man at the bottom at the bottom of the hill and a woman? There's a man in the, there's another man and a woman involved in this. The man is the getaway driver, okay? The man is the one that was driving the truck sitting at the bottom of the hill. There was a woman came up that hill on the back side and lured Summer out of there. Went in the house. Grandma distracted Candace long enough for this to happen. If you don't believe me, you wait another another two, three weeks. Wait another 
two, three weeks, tell me if if what I'm telling you ain't true. But okay. um, you cannot. All this bullshit about drugs this, drugs that, soda for this, soda for that, was written around in the shed. That's bullshit. All that's just a bunch of bullshit. What happened is Grandma saved that little girl's life. Seriously. I don't know, but there are people that do know. Like These law enforcement? Private investigators know, and the FBI knows. So why? But there's one, there's one, there's one missing piece, and that's the girl that lured her, at the, the woman that lured her away. And that's what they're waiting on. How do they know that some are safe? They got eyes all over her, honey. But they cannot finish what they started until they find out exactly who Grandma had to lure her away. Because Grandma's not talking. She's a friend. Grandma ain't been out here on a freaking joy ride vacation. Grandma's been in the box. Is she back in Tennessee? Yeah, she's back. She came back for about three days and gone again. Because she's going back to make sure Summer's okay and taking care of. <laughs> Grandma's going to be a hero. But now, now, see, here's the thing, Tiffany, we need people to stop showing Candace hate. We need people to, to say, you know, Candace, we know Don's got his foot on your throat. Stop. Stop. Get away from him. Leave his ass. Stop. Candace ain't the bad person here. You
if that's true. Oh, there's going to be a lot of people apologizing because that's why, that, that's why I always said from the beginning, don't worry about the who. Don't worry about the who. Who don't matter right now, you know? Uh, Pink, why, or, or, tell, you know, Pop, tell me, why do you think I ain't running around searching places and shit no more? Why do you think I ain't wasting my time doing it? Yeah, I did this billboard, but I did the billboard before I knew that what I just told you, okay? But I can't, I can't, I can't stop now. No. I can't just say, you know? No. So, I, I did the billboard before I knew what I just told you. Jace, if they don't know who the lady is, then who the fuck is Summer with? Some guy? No, 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 no. <sighs> All right. It's okay. Well, I just don't want... Is someone else hurting her? Like, I don't know. Is she safe? Is no. She... No. Only person that was hurting her was that motherfucker that is going to take everything I do to not reach in my pocket and pull this 9 millimeter out and put a bullet right through his fucking head tonight after I heard everything I heard. How are they going to prove that Summer was... Are, are they going to bring her to the doctor? Are they going to prove that she was hurt by him? How... Oh my God, I can't, I can't, I cannot. So Trish, when Trish came to me and told me that her mother had been raped by Don, and I said, why is Summer missing? Why is Summer missing? History repeats itself. To what? I said history repeats itself. Yeah. But you're doing it with your own fucking daughter. I'm telling you, Tiffany, it's gonna take all of my damn power tonight after I know what I know now. <laughs> when did you find no. out? Last week. Oh my God. So you see what I'm going through? You see what I'm fighting down here right now? When are they going to turn some... her over though? Like when are they going to turn her over to the authorities? Why can't they give summer to them? 10 to 14 days. Okay. Which is probably down to about 11 now. Does Penny know? Does Penny know? Yeah. No, but now let me tell you something. I, I mean, I ain't told Penny. But now Penny's smart. She's close to putting it together. Because, you know, she talks to me, but I ain't told her. I haven't told her. But, I mean, she's, she's, just, she's missing. She's missing. What, what everybody is missing is that Grandma ain't the bad person. People's missing that grandma's not the bad person and that Candace, honest to God, truly, when it happened, did not know. That's the only thing anybody's missing. Or that's the only thing Penny's missing. Jesus. But here's the thing. Do I trust Penny to tell her? Yeah, I do. Because I know she wouldn't say shit. <laughs> and I know she's, I know, unlike Scott, she's worried about that little girl. Scott would be great for YouTube. He'd want to be the first to break it out. He would fucking... That's no, I know, I know Penny is a good person. And I said it yesterday. She's the only person. Penny is the only person that cared to tell the truth about what happened that night. On John Q's, she's the only person that spoke to the truth about it, and she's the only person that didn't give a fuck. And she still went live, 
and she still talked about exactly what happened because it was taken down and hidden. I know Penny isn't a bad person. And I know that Penny's in it for summer. Scott, he's in it for he's spring. Shit. He's in it for his uh, And you know all this bullshit he's been going on about? Oh, my investment's this and my investment's mm-hmm. that. And it, bullshit. Mm-hmm. If he, now, he may have them, but I'll tell you what, he don't know how to manage them from what I've got. From what I've got right here in my fucking hands right now, he's a dirty son of a bitch. What do you have? Oh, I got a lot. I told you I had a lot more than what y'all had. A whole lot more. Wow. He's a he, he, he's a wife beater. He's a woman beater. He's a thief. I'm sure he's a he is. I'm sure he fucking is. Um, I know he's a woman beater just by what he did to me, and I didn't even have to be there in physical. But the thing of it is. The shape he's in right now, he's in no shape to run his mouth about anybody because that fucker can't even drive. He can't even get up to do shit. Yeah. And that motherfucker telling you and, and Penny not to work with me, not to tell you, uh, I've got a text message right here in my goddamn phone right now sent to me that he sent to some, some woman, and it ain't wasn't the Trixie, it was some woman that sent me the text message, and it said, there's too many men on here right now, we don't need Chase involved. Leave Chase alone. He told me to stay away from you, and that I couldn't trust you, and that you didn't have flyers, and that you didn't have this, and you didn't have that. Tiffany, the reason why I don't get on here and, and, and I go show shit is because I don't, because the first thing, the first time I do it, all anybody's going to say is, oh, that's some bitch just wants to say, look at me, look at me, look at me. The shit I do, I don't got a show on here. I know you don't. That's why I don't show everything. That's why I, it took me so long to do a live video on painting that shit out. Fuck him. So you need me to be there in the morning at 2 o'clock to make sure I'm in your chat with the wrench to mod for you? Is that what you mean? What? No, I want you to, I want you to uh, uh, stream it on your channel. You want me to stream it? Yeah. You okay. get more viewers, honey. Do you want, you know what? Do you, you know want me to just send you a link and you can come right on? You know like we did at the visual? Mm-hmm. That's... Do that. You want to, so you want me to send you a link? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, that's how we, yeah. Ain't that how we do it? Okay. So, I need to get down there. Uh, what I need to do first, I need to get down there and see what the, what the Wi-Fi situation is, okay? Yeah. And, and I'll get in touch with you and let you know exactly how we're going to do it. All right, honey? Yeah, uh, I will stay up. I'll take a nap. If you need me to be up at 2, I'll be up at 2. Just let me know if you want me to be... You need to be up at 2. I'm going to tell you that now. <laughs> okay, I will. I'll be up for you. And um, I'll go. I'll, uh, I'll go live for you. Uh, All right, Chase. Uh, 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 See you later. I'll talk to you later.
I did um, call to talk to Frank Light. Uh, I got a hold of a relative of his. And um, Frank was there, but Frank don't talk to no one. Um, his relative, absolutely, let's find her. Let's find her. Um, yeah, it was interesting. Um, I did talk to a family member of his and, um, very nice gentleman. Uh, not at first. <laughs> he wasn't because a lot of people's been calling them, saying stuff, being mean, and uh, trying to harass the family. Um, so I could understand um, fully why the gentleman was... And again, you know, there. Yeah, it was monitoring everything but the truth. Yeah, the police can <laughs> lie. I mean, they're not. They like if somebody. It's a good. You know, they they Lawson said. Yeah, I guess they passed. He can he can lie. Be lying because they what they want their them to let their guard down. Feel like oh we're you know you saw Doctor Phil oh Don looked like oh yeah when Doctor Phil oh said, yeah, I know he he you know, really got excited when I you know. know he thought he man he looked like we really yeah. pulled one over on you thank and you then, very and much then, and then he's telling some people some channel on YouTube he's like yo yeah, well Doctor Phil and the behavioral panel said I'm innocent they aren't the police <laughs> it's like <Yeah>. hello. <laughs> They're not law enforcement. <laughs> yeah, he must be. He's probably the one that sent her the toys <laughs> and told her to, you know, I would if I was TBI and heard about those toys, I would have went up there and confiscated, I would have confiscated those and took them down and had those um, those tested for um, for DNA. Toys. Are you talking about like to adult toys? Yes, I oh, would definitely. Um, I, don't, I, would I didn't definitely, hear about this one. I um, didn't hear about it. Right. I would have definitely uh, seen if those had any of the children's um, DNAs or anything. Oh, um, yeah, that's you know, Upon them, be because. Yep. I don't think anybody brought those up there. I think those were already there. Oh, I'm sure. And it, and it, and it is a good possibility that those were things they were using, um, <laughs> you know, to do some bad things with. Who knows? Um, that's disgusting. I mean, yeah, very disgusting. Very, yeah, it's sick. And knowing Benny probably told her to throw them away or, you know, get rid of them. And when did this are acting like somebody brought them there. Um, 
I do not believe anyone brought them there, to be perfectly honest with you. I think those things were already there. Oh, I'm sure they were. When did this happen? Yeah, who better to blame than Ernie, who we all know is in Florida. I know you're not a liar. You're, 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 you're a good person. You don't lie. I know that. But, you know, that's sad. I know we're to. Yeah. So, let me ask you a question. Was that real about, was there really dildos in your yard, though? Sex toys? Now, would I play a game like that? Fuck yeah, there was. I didn't know. See, I heard that Benny said that. I didn't know. And I promise you, I didn't have nothing to do with that. I wouldn't have wasted you know no what? toys like that. Okay, look. I don't know who did that shit. But whoever the fuck did that was a sick son of a bitch. I believe that. I believe that. You know, I, I agree on that. You know, when that happened, I was in Pennsylvania, by the way. Like I said, I don't know who did that. Everybody blamed you. Everybody blamed Benny. Everybody blamed everybody else. But where is the real culprit? Yeah. Who, 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 let me ask you a question. Who could? Who I was there? To, who I was around the area when it happened? Uh, me and my mom out? was the only one there. Okay. And now, which one? Uh, which one took? Uh, uh, which one? Uh, which, which camera system was up at that time? That was Benny's cameras, right? Um, there's a whole lot more cameras than Benny's. Uh, so, I mean, I mean, that's when he had his cameras up, all right? Hold on one second. I got to answer this shit. My mama's calling me. Hold on one second. You better answer your mama. And again, you know, there... Yeah, yeah, it was monitoring everything but the truth. Yeah. The police can lie. I mean, they're not, they, like, if somebody, it's a good, you know, they, they, Lawson said, yeah, I guess they passed. He can, he can lie, be lying because they, they want their, them to let their guard down, feel like, oh, we're, you know, you saw Dr. Phil, oh, Don looked like, oh, yeah, when Dr. Phil oh, said, yeah, I know, he, he you know, really got excited when, you I know. know, he thought he, man, he looked like we really yeah. pulled one over on you, thank and you then, very and much. Then, and then he's telling some people, some channel on YouTube, he's like, yo, well, Dr. Phil and the behavioral panel said I'm innocent. They aren't the police. <laughs> it's like, <Yeah>. hello. <laughs> They're not law enforcement. <laughs> yeah, he must be. He's probably the one that sent her the toys <laughs> and told her to. You know, I would if I was TBI and heard about those toys, I would have went up there and confiscated. I would have confiscated those and took them down and had those um, those tested for um, for DNA. Before. Are you talking about like to adult toys? Yes, I oh, would have definitely. Right. Um, I, I didn't hear about this one. I um, didn't hear about it. Right, I would have definitely uh, seen if those had any of the children's um, DNAs or anything. Oh, um, yeah, that's you know, upon them be because. Yep. I don't think anybody brought those up there. I think those were already there. Oh, I'm sure. And it, and it, and it is a good possibility that those were things they were using, um, you know, to do some bad things with. Who knows? Um, that's disgusting. I mean, yeah, very disgusting. Very, yeah, uh, it's sick. And knowing Benny probably told her to throw them away or, you know, get rid of them. And when did this are acting like somebody brought them there. Um, I do not believe anyone brought them there, to be perfectly honest with you. I think those things were already there. Oh, I'm sure they were. When did this happen? Yeah, who better to blame than Ernie, who we all know is in Florida. And we um, so we can't bring the results into court and say here he failed the test or he passed the test, that type of thing. It was more of an investigative aid. Rather than just explaining how a polygraph works, Detective Harms showed me. And that first meant getting hooked up to the machine. There's two pneumo tubes that we put on. One is for the upper chest, one is for the belly. Um, males are typically belly breathers. Females are typically chest breathers. We measure them both to, to cover both areas. And we look for um, slowing of the breathing, stopping breathing. People typically, if they tell a lie, 
they either hold their breath or their breathing slows way down. So we look for that, the uh, cardio, your blood pressure. In that, we look for um, spikes in your blood pressure, your heart rate, that type of thing. That's an indicator of somebody being deceptive. And then a galvanic skin response that measures the electrical conductivity in the skin when it's reacting to stimulus such as fear, that type of thing. So what I did is I had to write a number down, one through seven, um, write it down on a piece of paper, fold it up, put it in your pocket. I didn't see what number you wrote down. I was instructed to hold still, keep my feet flat on the floor, and fingers spread apart. Is the number you wrote down number two? No. Is the number you wrote down number four? No. Is the number you wrote down number seven? No. Once the test was finished, Detective Harms examined my reactions to each of the seven numbers to determine which one I had wrote down. So your breathing slows there. I'm going to go with number six. Are you that good? There you go. All right. When a person tells a lie, they relive that event. And it's the fear of being caught in the lie that triggers it's the autonomic nervous system is what it's called. Um, and that is broken down into the sympathetic and the parasympathetic. Um, and what that is, is there's the phrase fight, flight, or freeze. The adrenaline rush that you get, that's the sympathetic portion of the autonomic nervous system that kicks in to protect the body. Um, the parasympathetic then tries to bring the body back down to homeostasis, normal, everyday life, that type of thing. Um, when I'm explaining it to somebody, the polygraph test, when I'm explaining the polygraph test to um, a person coming in taking a polygraph, I basically ask them, have you watched a scary movie before? They typically say yes. I'm like, you know, as you're watching the scary movie, the scary part comes, you start to get the goosebumps, the adrenaline rush. The scary part comes, you jump, you scream, whatever it is that you do, and then you go back down to normal. That's the autonomic nervous system in the body. I can't control that with the polygraph. Um, they can't control that. It's a natural reaction in the body. And that's basically what it measures. I know you're not a liar. You're, 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 you're a good person. You don't lie. I know that. But, you know, that's... I know we're going to yeah. So let me ask you a question. Was that real about, was there really dildos in your yard, though? Sex toys? Now, would I play a game like that? Fuck yeah, there was. I didn't know. See, I heard that Benny said that. I didn't know. And I promise you, I didn't have nothing to do with that. I wasn't wasting you know no what? toys like that. Okay, look, I don't know who did that shit, but whoever the fuck did that was a sick son of a bitch. I believe that. I believe that. You know, I agree on that. You know, when that happened, I was in Pennsylvania, by the way. Like I said, I don't know who did that. Everybody blamed you. Everybody blamed Benny. Everybody blamed everybody else. But where is the real culprit? Yeah. Who, 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 let me ask you a question. Who could? It, who I was there, to, who I was around the area when it happened? Uh, me you and my mom on? was the only one there. Okay. And now, which one, uh, which one took, uh, uh, which one, um, which which camera system was up at that time? That was Benny's cameras, right? Um, there's a whole lot more cameras than Benny's. Uh, so I mean, I mean, that's when he had his cameras up, all right. Hold on one second. I gotta answer this shit. My mama's calling me. Hold on one second. You better answer your mama.